Okay, when, if I get this thing working, I've got more stuff I've been planning to do. So I've got um, Sony TCD D3, um, portable DAT recorder, and a TCD uh, D5 or D7? It's a D7. Where does it say it? So it's somewhere on here. D7. Um, of course, being DAT recorders, they don't open because the, the eject is motorized. Um, so I do have power supply for one, which uh, came with a US plug that someone has craftedly <laughs> converted to Australian. <laughs> um, that's because the it's a universal power supply. Uh, 100, 100 volts to 240 and two outputs, nine volts and seven and a half volts. I guess, yeah, one of them's to, um, to charge the battery pack that can go on the back of the, of the D3. So they do both power up, um, but they don't eject. I think I might have managed, this one actually had a tape in it, I think. Maybe I did get this one to eject, but it doesn't play. I'm not sure because of course this power supply doesn't fit this one. So let me just get set up. Okay, she's plugged in and eject, eject. Oh, gotta turn the power on. Now eject. And she doesn't. So there is actually, I watched a very good video last night, another Aussie. So you've got to go in through the bottom. It's incredible, incredible um, mechanical workmanship. So you've got to go in through the bottom and then you can get basically the top off. And there is actually a test point on there that you can solder that gives you more ideas, but um, yeah, I'm guessing one of the um, one or more of the gears is uh, not working the way it should be. So yeah, it's more stuff I've been planning planning to fix for years and years. Um, I've got tapes. Oh, actually, I've got a DAT, DAT recorder upstairs that's working. Um, interesting thing is because obviously audio DAT. Um, Morza didn't really take off in the consumer space. They've got um, these 124-minute DAT tapes, but um, yeah, we certainly did use them in um, for data storage as DDS tapes, digital data system. So yeah, we used them in Nokia for MSCs, BSCs for delivering software on. This is just a DDS one, I think. Well, that's going back quite a few years for HLR. And uh, well, this is a DDS4, 40 gig. DDS4, yeah, the DDS4, DDS1. Don't think these work in DAT drives, unfortunately. <laughs> Even though they're physically the same. So DAT tape, DDS tape. Um, yeah, I have tried it, so, anyway, so, yeah, so, at some stage, I'll hopefully be fixing that one, and be fixing that one, I've got a UK power supply for this one, um, like a battery, it actually, uh, has a battery pack that you can pull out, um, yeah, not bad for Sony actually, considering Sony's battery types. Yeah, but slightly different, slightly different power supply. So it just doesn't fit. Anyway, I just wanted to do a quick video about that. Um, yeah, back to the back to the Grundy.